Hey, how's it going everybody? Out here on another hike today. Just a quick video, not gonna do much talking. I uh, brought some food with me, my Firebox Nano stove, and I'm gonna cook it up. Found a new place, same area that I normally come to, but I just hiked back a little bit further, follow these animal trails in, and actually found this really cool oak tree with a nice little area to sit down uh, where, the, where the root grows. So enjoy today's video. Thanks for watching.
Very good. Really good. So the only thing you have to uh, kind of keep an eye on is not only do you have to keep feeding the nano stove to keep your temperature up, just because it is a smaller stove. Uh, if you're going to be using titanium, this is the Keith uh, titanium skillet, folding skillet, and it's got the non-stick coating on the inside. If you're going to be using something like this, it will cook your food super quick and burn it to the bottom, or, or you know, so you've got to constantly pull it up off the fire, like what I was showing you, to regulate it. Um, other than that, it's it's really easy. Cooks your food really well. Really, really good. All done. In case you're wondering how I'm going to go about cleaning this up, uh, I always keep a wad of toilet paper in my pack with me, or I try to, just in case duty calls. So with this being non-stick, it wipes out pretty easy. This piece of toilet paper. Whatever's left on there that's kind of a little stuck on the bottom or some gunk or something, I can clean it up when I get back. But I'll just do this. Fold up the skillet. And then I'll just take my lighter and burn this. Way I'm not leaving any trace, you know. And I'll just burn it wherever I had my firebox fire right here. Just like that. And then another trick with uh, any wood burning stoves that I do is I go ahead and use a couple of sticks found on the ground. And I go ahead and dump out the little bit of coals and ash and stuff that's left in there so that this cools down a lot quicker. Because I guess that's the only knock that some people have on these wood stoves is that you gotta wait for them to cool down. So that way it cools down a little bit quicker. And then I get my water a little bit of water and I go ahead and put all this out so that it doesn't have a chance to start back up when I'm gone. Just like that. Well, thanks for watching today's video. It's just a real quick one to me use my firebox stove to cook up some sausage and eggs. If you're interested in any of the companies that I use today, I'll put links to their website in the description box below. Remember, get outside and enjoy the woods. Thanks for watching.